two circles together. That's right. Tangent circles, right? Okay, now we have two centers right here. Okay, then over here. Then all the bigger circle, that radius is 12 inches. That smaller one, 7 inches. Oh, then we are looking for tangent line. That's a common tangent line, right? So actually from the point right there uh, to that. Okay. Then, oh, very simple. Now, so we know, uh, so we're going to connect these centers together. Just like this. Oh, that's right. Okay. Then how long that will be? Then, oh, that's right. This one is 12. And this one is 7 together, 19 inches. That's right. Okay, 19. Remember that. Now, uh, actually, we are looking for this one. Okay, I'm going to put T because a tangent line. How about that? Okay, so lowercase t. Okay, so now, okay, you can use X if you want. Okay. Then I'm going to put this uh, radius right there. Ooh, now right there. Oh, that's it. Then, hey, I can label now. Okay, so now this one going to be 12 and this going to be 7. That's right. Then, hey, also I'm going to put another line. So from here to all the way, just like this. Oh, that's right. Then, oh, just like that. Then, oh, this is going to be 90 degrees. Oh, right there. Okay, then we generated one triangle. Let's label again. Okay, right here, a small triangle, thin, long triangle. Okay, this one is oh, 12 and 7 together, 19. Okay, so what about this one right there? Oh, 12 minus 7, which is a 5, right? Okay, 5 right there. Then actually we are looking for T. Okay, so over here okay so that means hey all done right okay t equals square root sign okay just like that okay then uh actually 19 that's a hypotenuse okay 19 squared which is 361 minus 5 squared which is 25 that's it so which is a uh, square root of 336 right okay 336 which is oh uh, you can take that's right okay 16 out right which is the 4 okay then inside that's it 21 left oh man so 4 square root of 21 inches that's it what about this oh big circle 12 inch diameter uh, radius and 7 inch uh, radius okay right there separated by let's say 6 inches apart okay how about that then uh yeah, 6 inches right there then actually from here to all the way to the center to center is a 12 plus 7 which is 19 plus 6 total 25 right oh very simple see from here to all the way to the center that's it okay that's 25 also we could put oh uh, that's right radius right there ah beautiful look at that oh radius right there Whew. then always remember the tangent line and a uh, radius always 90 degree right perpendicular okay just like this okay never make this one so a lot of people okay even yesterday oh a lot of kids made mistake on this one make this one 90 degree no okay this one is 90 okay that's the only thing you have to be careful okay now then we could make one two thin long triangle just like that okay then actually we are looking for this length which is a tangent line which is I'm gonna call it T again okay which is a T right there 
Okay, then this one, oh, that's right, 12 minus 7, which is 5, right there. Okay, then, oh, this one, hypotenuse, okay, longest one, which is 25, right? So, okay, 12, 6, 7, total 25, that's it. Then, hey, actually the same thing right there. Okay, T equals, okay, square root sign. Just like that. Okay, then 25 squared, which is 625, minus 5 squared, which is what? 25. That's it. Okay, so 625 minus that one, which is square root of 600. That's it. Oh, fantastic. Then, oh, this one is easy to convert, right? Simplifying. Okay, 100 times 6, that's why 10 square root 6 inches. That's it. Okay, what about this one then? Oh, same two circles. Okay, so right there, which is T to T. So I'm going to call this one T, okay? So, which is, we are looking for this uh, tangent line. That's it. Okay, now, uh, this one apart, that's right. I told you that was six inches apart. Okay, that's it. This one right there, that's 12. Okay, this one, seven. Okay. Oh, let's try now. Okay, the same way. Actually, I gotta put this uh, radius right there, right? Okay, right there. Then this radius, right here okay which is 90 degree to that tangent line that's it perpendicular okay just like that then also I'm gonna connect this one all the way to the center to center okay that's it oh in this case oh wait a minute you know what that's right you got the idea right okay so now I'm gonna connect this one right there or uh, maybe I can uh, use this one right there okay so just like this one I okay extend this one just like that then I put this one just like this oh yes now T is right here okay so T now how long this this one gonna be that's right okay 12 plus 7 which is 19. Oh, this one is 19. Okay, what about this long one, hypotenuse? Oh, that's right. So this one, 19 plus this one, 25 again. Oh, wait a minute. So we are looking for T. Oh, that's it. So we are looking at this big triangle right there. See, that's it. Very simple, right? Almost done. Now, okay, T equals, oh, square root again. See, we are using Pythagorean theorem. That's it. Now, okay, 25 squared, which is 625. Okay, so 25 squared minus 19 squared, which is 361. Ah, very simple. Yep, almost done now. Okay, square root. Then, oh, so 625 minus 361, which is 264. That's it. Just like that. Okay, which is? Oh, that's right. So you can divide the, this one by 4. That's why 2, then square root. Oh, that's right. Divide by 4, which is 66. Oh, that's it. Beautiful answer right there. See? 2 square root of 66, which is 66 means what? Okay, a little more than 8, right? 8 times 2, which is about 16. That's it. Uh, oh, this one is 25. This one is 19. Yep, just about right. That's it.